Today we're going to talk about justice. When you have an apparent injustice in your life, it troubles you a great deal. It does most people. We find it hard to reconcile injustice with our desire to believe in God's unfailing law of good. Jesus told us that we are not to judge by appearances, but that we are to judge with right judgment. In the face of apparent injustice, let us hold to our faith in the goodness of God. Let us know that injustice cannot stand, that in ways that we may not be able to see or comprehend in the moment, order and right conditions are being established. Someone has said that justice is truth in action. Well, we are to help promote justice as we are just and we are fair in all ways, as we treat others in the way that we desire and expect them to treat us. We help to promote justice as we withhold judgment or condemnation and place our faith in the wisdom and the power and the love of God to set all things in order to establish justice and right conditions. I pray today that you have faith in divine justice. I remember a lady that was in my ministry years ago. She had a real injustice in her life. She sat in my office and she cried and she said, I'm so bitter, I'm so filled with hate. And I said to her, I said, you don't want to live that way. It is drinking the poison that someone else has given you and, and holding it in you and allowing it to kill you. Rather, learn from this. Sometimes we can learn watching people do really wrong and bad things. And we can decide in our own life to go another way. And if we do that, if we learn from that and do that, well, it is a real blessing in the long term. That lady and I, we decided together in prayer that we would turn that around and she would begin to live her life giving justice to all people. I knew that lady for over 30 years after that. She always treated other people with respect. She told me that the bitterness just melted away. It no longer existed. And people started to treat her in a new and a profound, wonderful, loving way. And therefore, she said to me, it took many years, but she said to me, she said, you know, that was one of the greatest things that ever happened to me. Because it turned me around in my way of living. I pray that you live your life in a justice that you judge with right judgment, and that you have a power inside of you that brings good to you constantly as you bring good to others. God bless you.